Hi guys, I am Ayengiran. I am going to do a presentation on challenges in social media analytics. Here I have around six challenges to present you guys. The first challenge is big data analytics challenges. Because when it comes to social media analytics, you are going to deal with multiple platforms and sources. Right? When you collect the data from multiple platforms and sources, you are going to have a huge amount of data right? to store them and process them you need a powerful computer right and also when you work with multiple platforms and sources you are going to have a different different data structures let's say now when you work with a you when you work with youtube you are you are going to have a different structure maybe it is coming in a json format and when you get the data from facebook you have a different structure Maybe that is coming in CSV format, right? Likewise, you are going to have a different different type of data from different different platforms. Right? To analyze them, if first of all, you need to bring them together into a single source and to a common format. Right? That is going to be a challenging task for us because we need a powerful computer and also we need powerful tool to process it right it is actually a challenging task when it comes to social media analytics right the second challenge is bringing the gap between social sciences and computer sciences because the social media analytics is an interdisciplinary field but the social media data is going to be analyzed by researchers with different backgrounds Actually, this gap is a major challenge throughout the research process because social scientists actually they will not have experience on discovering and collecting and processing large and relevant social media data because as you know they don't have much experience with the tools and software architectures to process it right because of that reason it is going to be a challenging task when it comes to social media analytics for them. The third challenge is discovering, discovering, discover relevant topics and events. Because of the volume of the data, it is make it is going to make us difficult to discover the relevant topics and trends and events in dynamic social media communication. Because people are going to come from different different locations or from different different countries. In that case, people will use different different languages let's say right for example some people will use english and some people will use their own language and also some people will use images and videos to communicate right in that case what we need to do actually we need to get all the data we need to get the data from all these different languages and images and videos right it is actually a challenging task because we need to deal with different different platforms or oh sorry different different software tools to process it right because of that reason again it is going to be a challenging task for us the fourth challenge is choosing an appropriate software architecture and storage technology because again it is because of the volume and the velocity of the data right because here we have to choose a proper software architecture and storage technology we can't use a single our single computer to process it because maybe we have to use multiple computers or some kind of different architecture and also we can't use our relational database management systems like ms sql server or sql mysql server or other relational database management system because Sometimes you will be able to store the data, but it will be slow to process it. Right? In that case, we have to find out at this stage, actually, we have to find out a proper software architecture and storage technology to deal with it. Right? This is one of the major challenge when it comes to social media analytics. Right? And the fifth challenge is obtaining high quality data. Because most of the time, when it comes to social media analytics, we are going to have a 
incomplete or noisy data right because sometimes you will have user will not given the permission to provide the data sometimes you will have to pay for it to get the data likewise there are some restrictions actually in that case maybe you will have a missing information right that makes you that will make you to uh, difficult in analyzing the data okay because of that reason obtaining high quality data is a challenging task when it comes to social media analytics right and the sixth challenge is visualize the data meaningfully because you are going to have a huge amount of data right to process it and to generate a graphs or meaningful graphs you need again a powerful tools to process it right or you need to perform some additional computer operations to perform it to make it meaningful right this is actually one of the major challenge again when it comes to the social media analytics these challenges we will face in a different different stages for example we will face the challenges in this in interdisciplinary nature or event and topic deduction when it comes to discovery stage right and you will have challenges in choosing a software architecture when it comes to tracking stage there you have different different databases and different different platforms and different different data structures and there you have to find out a proper software architecture to process it right and then when it's come to preparation step you are going to face the challenges in visualization data visualization and the data quality right if you can overcome those issues then finally or challenges then you can finally produce a proper report and that will give a clear idea about what is happening in the business or whatever the things that you are analyzing uh those are the challenges that i wanted to present you guys please let me know if you have any doubt or questions thank you